Hello everyone, I'm back once again with the next video and today we are going to learn how LinkedIn Boolean works. Yes, in my previous so many videos, you might have understood what is a Boolean. But do you know, this regular Boolean cannot work with the LinkedIn. Yes, it can work, but up to certain limitations. So what are the limitations? How to overcome that? That we are going to learn in this video today. So say, stay tuned, watch the video till end and do comment and let me know what are the topics you want me to record on. Now let's go and let's start our learning. Hello everyone. Now let's start learning about the LinkedIn Boolean. In my previous videos, I have explained you all what is Boolean. Boolean is the combination of some operators like and or not quotes and parentheses. And, but do you know? The same regular Boolean cannot work on LinkedIn. LinkedIn has some limitations that LinkedIn only allow you to go with maximum six keywords, five operators. If you will put more than six keywords in the LinkedIn Boolean, then you will get no results. So today we are going to see that how I can avoid that restriction. We have to create a separate LinkedIn Boolean for that. A normal Boolean is very simple with AND or NOT quotes in parentheses, but a LinkedIn Boolean has few rules. That means if you want to put more than six keywords in the LinkedIn to get your right results, because the more keyword you will get, the more filtered results you will get. But LinkedIn has limited you. You won't be able to put more than six keywords in the LinkedIn. If you will, you can try today. If you will try putting more than six keywords, LinkedIn will say no results. So in that situation, you have to follow the four rules of the LinkedIn. What are those four rules? You have to always start, see the sheet here. So you have to always start the Boolean with one parenthesis. Excluding the first keyword, each keyword has to be in the parenthesis and quotes. No space after or. Before changing the operator, we have to close the parenthesis. Now see here, I have started this Boolean with the parenthesis. So excluding the first sales manager, all other keywords, manager, sales, online sales, B2B sales, B2C sales, account manager, everything is in the quotes and parenthesis. There is no space after or. And before changing the operator, as soon as my or keywords are finished, now skill sets I want compulsory and keep operator is coming, I have closed the parenthesis at sales head. So these are the four rules of building the LinkedIn Boolean. Start with the parenthesis, excluding the first keyword, put each keyword in parenthesis and quotes, no space after or after the last keyword of the same column, close your parenthesis and move, follow the same process. Same way we will open that in B2B. Excluding B2B, B2C has to be in the quotes and parentheses as B2C is the separate last keyword. New operator is coming again. We have to close that at B2C, no space after or. Now, if you will use this technique, then you can add n number of operators. So if you have liked the today's trick, hit like, comment and let me know what are the videos you want me to record on. Do visit our website www.theskilldeck.com and download our application to buy any pre-recorded courses of the Skill Deck. See you in the next video. Bye then. Take care. Bye-bye.